My beautician said she is on quarantine, as we all are, and thus will not be doing hair. Um, Let me ask you a question. When you're on quarantine, do you get to wear a bra? So this is my little office. You know how. She ain't got no bra on. Hey, I reserve the right to not wear one. <laughs> Those are my little books and other stuff. But, um, okay, it's so look. so long. <laughs> this is me, bam. This is me. It's messy desk, just like at the job. No place like home. This is my little office. I hope you are not recording me. I'm not putting you on camera. Damn. Put me on camera. So the headphones are so, you know, Dino could be in the living room doing his thizzle over there. And then I'm over here with my two laptops. And then I go upstairs and I have a little, I have like two tables, two little tables and some gamer chairs. Like this is a gamer chair. And there's the chairs up there and I have the boys do their work. And of course my teenager has to be, has to be different and do her work in her bedroom. But that's how it is. So. Look, this one I'm trying to figure out. I, I I was supposed to go see my doctor today. Nope. But I felt like No. Tell, I wasn't tell trying to right. go. I tell wasn't trying to go right. because what are you talking about? Tell right. Why are you saying that? I didn't want to go. No, you was you was itching to go. I was dying to go. Oh my right. god, I what's that called? Cabin fever. Right. I have to go somewhere every but your day. I have was like, hold up. Wait a minute. Tell a story right, nigga. So, I mean, black woman. Thank you. The story is, I got headbutted right here. Oh, my God. About a month ago by one of my students. <laughs> <clears throat> he didn't mean no harm. He didn't mean no harm. That's my son bumbling down the stairs. Hi. Anyway, so they sent me to physical therapy. And so I'm supposed to get physical therapy. But I'm like, I don't be feeling all comfortable with people touching me and stuff right now. You know what I'm saying? I don't know how I feel about that. You got the rotors. But, you know, I don't want to not be in compliance with workers' comp or whatever politics. But, you know, Dino brought up a good point. He was like, why you got to... He sweat me about even going to get water. Why do I need to go cross town to, you know... I sweat you about getting water because we already had 15 gallons. Ever. Never have enough. <laughs> Can I put you on camera now? No. Anyway, what y'all doing? What y'all doing today, man? What y'all doing? Come here. Give me a hug. Come on, camera. Watch your step. That's my office. No, you're not using it. So I don't know about y'all, but I've been cutting my children off the electronics a bit. I've been... um. Okay, bye. Ironically, right? Because you see my office. This is my office right here. Bam, 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 bam. But <clears throat> with the children... I feel like only for academic things. Like today, the theme was supposed to be like NASA.gov. If you can, have your children or yourself, if you enjoy those things, go to NASA.gov. That's N-A-S-A dot G-O-V. They have a whole lot of activities that are going on. And because we're going into the equinox or whatever, we've been going into that for about a week. The Southern Hemisphere is closer to the sun. And your children can see some of that. So, okay, I see it. Ain't nobody watching me anyway. So it don't even matter. How, okay, so NASA.gov. I wanted to also mention um, Starfall.com is a very good website. Um, it taught all of my children how to read. Every, I mean, I taught my children. But I'm saying it's a good website that helps promote education. What's another one? I didn't want to leave without giving some. Um, if you know any children with autism, <clears throat> get back. Go. Um. The Autism Helper, the AutismHelper.com has like an eight-week program for children with autism. Um, special things that, you know, go along with the different behaviors that, that um, you know, there's different exercises and videos and practices that the children can, can do. And that's K through 12. Um, let's see. What is another website? I already said code.org the other day. That's a cool one. Code, C-O-D-E dot org. That's a science technology one too. And um, it's fun because the kids learn how to um, do HTML with like animated stuff and music. And it's a lot of fun. So that's it. 
I guess everybody got off because they they couldn't deal with my my hair. My hair, you my hair. As I was told, I like it. This is an ode to the professors of the late 1800s, early 1900s. They used to wear it in a rolled up bun on the top and then have it in the front. Bam. So that's my ode to them. There's a movie out on Netflix called um, Self Made. It's a fictitious story about Madam C.J. Walker and another sister. I forget her name. Annie. I forget. The real OG from Detroit. Now, absolutely nobody's watching me now. First, I had like seven. Then I had like five. Then I had like one. Now I have like like just the live button. <laughs> And, and I don't have the glam hair. You ain't talking about shit. I'm totally talking about good stuff for those who are watching. Anyways. Time to go. All right, then. What's up, y'all? I'm about to go now. <laughs> go spend time yeah. with my husband. Yeah. But you know what? I've been working with kids. Let's do it, And man. all this all online right. teaching stuff is really, really deep. But um, all right, that's it. I just wanted to say what I said. I hope y'all been watching... Some of the little video stuff I've been putting together. Why is it 80 degrees in here? I don't know. It's just hot. The, it's not the heater. It's just the the temperature of the house. It's hot. And then um, um, heavenly, hot. heavenly, heavenly. Like totally like go listen to heavenly okay. if you haven't listened to it yet. And wow. we're talking about doing a music video for it while we're in the house. You know, you know what I'm saying? So. Peace. Unless you have something to ask.